social banking from GT Bank. Anywhere, anytime, any device. Welcome to The Big Juice. On the couch today, we have the surest boy in Africa. It's May D. Welcome. Good How you doing? Rewind, take us back a few good years. What was life like before the fame, the fortune? It's like, you know, trying to charge your phone with a bad charger and all that, you get me? So many stuff like that. Like, you know. Wait, I don't understand. What do you mean trying to charge your phone with a bad charger? <laughs> I I've never to <laughs> Like, you know, trying to charge your phone, but you're trying to get, like, have to like twist the charger, like, okay. put it like that and like that. Right, right, Hit okay. the phone like that, you know, that kind of thing. So that was what life was like for yeah. you before. <laughs> <laughs> So you were yeah. studying mass communications. Yeah. Why didn't you sort of pursue the mass communications angle for a bit and then maybe do music on the side? Why did you just decide to go straight into music, like 100%? Okay, it's just like giving me, uh, what's it called? Bread and water and then giving me, you know, normal rice, plantain, chicken and everything. Which one would you choose? Well, I'm trying to stay away from carbs, so, you know. <laughs> <laughs> if you'd said like, I don't know, chicken and vegetable soup now, maybe. But so the rice, chicken, and plant. So that was the music. Yeah, so that's music. Okay. So what was what exactly did you do? What was the process? Did you how how did you meet P Square? What were you doing? You know, in the music industry before you met them. Uh yeah, I was hustling as usual. You know, uh, I was, you know, going jumping from one studio to the other, trying to save money to you know for studio time, and all that. Then. Then, uh, and, I, and I went for this tour that I wasn't called for. Mm -hmm. um, what was it called again? Uh, Two Face and Friends. Yeah. It was, so it, it you was crashed. actually my friends that, that you crashed organized the, the tour. <laughs> it was actually my friends that organized the tour then, you get me? So was, all throughout this whole thing, you were like the opening act? Yeah, kind of. You okay. know, one of the opening acts. Mm. Yeah, so I met Alai. Alai, you know, he's a rapper in UK. Yeah. So I met him at the Lagos Zone. You get me? So it was like, ah, dude, nice one. Ah, let's work now, you know, from there. We just started rolling together. You know, anytime he's in the country, he calls me, we hook up, go for shows together with him, you know. From there, we started recording. And that was when I did a song with Kel. And mm. I'm like, hey, too fine. Yes, 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 yeah. yes, yes. Wow, that was, a, that was a hot minute ago. Yeah, so you did that. And then what happened after that? How did you go from rolling with LA to rolling with Peace Yeah, by the time I was doing Farabala, we showed them camp, you get me. Peace Square's eyes were already on me then. You know, they were like, ah, this guy, you know, one thing, one thing, we have to work, we have to do this, da, da, da. I'm like, oh, why not? Yeah. So who, who called you? Was it one of the twins or was it? Uh, it was Peter, no. Peter, okay. my guy. My guy, my guy. And what did he <laughs> say to you? No, it was just like, it was just like, ah, guy, I found out, they hear your voice every time we really play TV. We just they sing things. Ah, do something, I'm like, yeah, I just go on my promo CD, I just play it. I was like, ah. So things kind of did go a bit sour, but you guys have made up now. Um, we, we still don't know exactly what went wrong, because there were all these different stories. So from your... The horse's mouth, probably. Yes. <laughs> I actually don't know what happened. You know, I actually just woke up like every other person. I saw it on Twitter. You gave me that to whom it concerned. Uh -huh. so, so it was a complete shock? Yeah, it was a complete shock. Oh, wow. Me. Yeah, but at, at that period, yeah, we were going back and forth on, you know, um, some contract issues and all okay, that. Okay, so terms With of my your manager contract. And their everything. manager okay. and all that, yeah. So, and I guess, I guess that was it. And most, most times, yeah, I hear that they say, ah, why did you leave this? Why did you? I actually didn't leave them. You get me? Because if I did, I would be the one writing something on Twitter. Mm. You get me? I actually didn't. I just woke up and saw it on Twitter and I'm like, ah, what's going on? Were you still living in... No, I wasn't. Okay. All right, you went. I wasn't. Okay. okay. So, so what, what happened next? Because you saw it on Twitter. So, like, if that happened to me, I'd call and be like, um, guys, I'm, I'm reading something on Twitter. I'm a bit confused. So what, what was the next thing you did? Yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't so surprised like that. You get me? I was, I was actually surprised, but not so surprised because, you know... So you were kind of, you were expecting on, it? Yeah, I was, I, I wasn't expecting it. Rumor has it that you were, um, you were asking for 
like a I think what a like house, a house a car, car all these you know big things were you asking <coughs> for like a house on banana island or actually you know actually no no but you get me you know you know for it was a platform mm -hmm. you get me and you know when it comes when it when it comes you know we didn't talk about nothing about no contract right from the beginning so you know when that comes in you need to deal with business mm -hmm. you know it has become business you get me so I guess maybe it was my manager and their manager that were going back and forth on that, mm. you know, but I was actually cool with anything. So you weren't, you weren't necessarily like involved no, in no. the conversation. Okay. Are you still with this manager? Yeah. yeah. Okay. But yeah. how have things sort of changed? Like, what are you doing now that you probably wouldn't have done or wouldn't have been able to do? No, if you that's, were... that, that's not exactly how I mean it. But, okay. You know, I'm just like, obviously I appreciate, mm -hmm. you know, um, the whole, thing that went on together between Pisca and I, you get me, it wasn't, you know, nobody actually helped me but them, mm. you get me, then when I was down, nobody actually helped me, but they did, mm. so that's why I appreciate them for that. Well, you have actually gone in a bit of a different direction, because yeah. you're doing, you know, collabos, you've got the Mafiki Zola one, Happiness, yeah. amazing, amazing. So how did that come about? How easy was it to, you know, lock them down and just say, okay, let's do this? Okay, um, Mafiki Zola. I was actually at an event in South Africa and you know Skido is kind of like their manager or their you know PR person and all that so he was at the event too and he just went to meet my manager while I was performing and I was mm. like I want that guy you know and my manager I didn't know him from nowhere and was like who are you dude like <laughs> <laughs> shifts <laughs> yeah so, so it was later when he came to meet me he was like ah that do I know any of Skido I'm like ah or skinny. That was skinny, a bad producer. Da, da, da. It was like, oh, okay, da. he said he wants me in the studio with Mafiki Zolo. And I'm like, ah, why not now? I didn't even know who Mafiki Zolo was then, you get me? <gasps> they are no drop Konana. So, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, right. so I'm, I'm kind of like, <laughs> excuse me. So I didn't know who they were, but they, they've been around for like ages. Yeah, though, they've been around me? for, yeah, for a while. Yeah. So I was like, ah, okay, let's get into the studio. So we're going to the studio. They played me a whole lot of their tracks and everything, and I'm like, ah, okay, mad, oh, mad. And they were like, I should choose the one I'd like to feature, and I'm like, happiness. Happiness, so. When was the last time you made a song that as soon as you, you know, wrapped everything up in the studio, you were like, man, that is a killer jam? Like, almost every week. <laughs> Is it, is this, is this, is it what other people tell you, what you tell yourself? What I tell myself is what my tell like most to, for my happiness. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, you do have a gorgeous son, yeah. Olami Podju. Iba. Yes. Okay, and how old is he now? He's about a year and three months. A year and three months. Uh, does he dance to your music? No. Really? What do you think he, his favorite track of yours is? Get down. <laughs> okay, so we, we live in a, a, a fairly, you know, conservative, you know, society. And I'm sure when you had your son, you had like a lot of people saying you didn't do it the proper way. You didn't get married and, you know. So <laughs> what are your thoughts on that? Because there are quite a few artists that have kids that, you know, didn't get married and do face criticism. But what are your thoughts on that? Do you think that, look, it's my life, I can do whatever or... I wish I had, done, I had done it that way. Ain't nobody's business, just mine and my baby. Yeah. <laughs> nobody's business. <laughs> but do you, do you plan to, um, you know, walk down the aisle with her one day? Why would I plan to walk down the aisle one day in my life? With this do lady? I want to remain single forever? With this very lady? <laughs> do, you, do you plan to? Uh, yes, you know. You know, no one ever wants to like have like a child. Oh, you heard it on the juice first. Another celebrity wedding coming 2015. Hey, I never said it till like that. Too. Have you picked a ring yet? <sighs> See, to uh, trying to be the pastor of a wedding that. Well, you good. said I'm just you know. That there's no IV yet. Actually, there's there's no plan for marriage at the moment. You mean this month? At the moment. <laughs> Uh, politician to this buy. quarter eh? this quarter or this year or what do you mean no at the moment like in the next five years no. next five years mm. 
Wow. Okay. Yeah. Um, I still have lots more questions for Mady. <laughs> we'll okay. be right back after this break. <laughs> Welcome back to The Juice. We still have the surest guy. I'm going to call you guy now. I feel more comfortable saying sure that. Guy. Ah, yes, no, sure sound guy. Like, doesn't okay. sound buff. Sure boy. Ah, the surest oh boy. Oh <laughs> the, surest, <laughs> the surest boy in Africa. He's still on The Juice couch. And um, you have been very, very clever in answering your questions. You've yeah, kind of just you. been quite evasive in everything. Thank you very much. Mm. Even when I asked about your ride or die chick, how long have you known her? That's like, it's women that always remember all these things. And you better remember, at least try to. I'll try my best, yeah. don't worry. I'll remember before the show ends. You get me? <laughs> I reckon she's very laid back. You know? If I was, if I was, you know, I was watching, I'd be like, what? To be taken off my earrings, I'll just wait for you at the door. <laughs> yes. Be like, you don't remember when we met? It's ladies that always remember that, man. You, you should have, like, is it five years ago, 10 years ago, 15 years ago? 15? Oh, that's like marriage. Oh. So we're going to play a game or two. This one is called I've Got Dance in My Pants. Dance? In my pants. Am I going to dance? Yes. You're going to have to stand up for this one. Now? Yes, please. Where do I stand here? Yeah? Yep, you can stand there. Wind deck. Yes, no, yes, 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 he did good, he did good. <laughs> Makosa. Yes, 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 yes. He has got that, so he's got it, he's got it, he got it. And we've got one more, right? One more. I don't know yet, we've got to wait and see. Galala. Yes, no. Yes, 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 yes. I think he did very well. I think he did. One more. Okay, the last one. You, you've won this. You've won this. Hands down. Okay, last one. Elaine Joe. <laughs> now, wait, wait. Did he get that one right? I, I actually, actually, <laughs> you did, you did, you did. Yeah, well, done, well, done, well done, well done. <laughs> you can sit down. It's okay, oh, you can sit down. You. So, you won. Thank you very much for stopping by. Best of luck with everything and your tour. Oh. Appreciate it. Thank you. So, bye. I'm Tools. If you enjoyed watching that, make sure you subscribe to the Indani TV channel. And you can also watch more videos here.